become one of the, I would say one of the longest, <laughs> most dedicated park supporters that we have. Please honor this elder with me, Rosie, the artist, the, <laughs> the peacemaker. How are everybody, how are everybody doing today? All right. I want to say one thing before I start. Berkeley, UC Berkeley is good for students, but it's toxic for the people. And we need to change that. We need to redirect people, I mean, UC Berkeley attitude in a different direction. They need to exchange their priorities in a different direction because the people need this park. And it's good that they're giving people a place to live. They should have done that a long time ago. But one thing I want you to know, that we're gonna fight. I'm gonna take a, I'm gonna take a page from Donald Trump. We need, we need strength. We need power. We need to fight. We, need, we have to be prepared for battle to take this part. Not to take it, but to keep it for the people. Because once these people get housed and use at, at, at People's Park, they will have housing. They will live in luxury, something they deserve. To have a big screen TV, to have a shower, to so they can take a shower the time they want. But there could be a new wave of homeless people coming out soon and the park won't be there for them. We need to keep the park there for them. Yeah. So they'll have a place to go where there's no other place to go. When I first came to this to Berkeley, I had no money. I had no job. I had to learn how to survive. I had to start doing portrait. I had to start drawing people because I, I couldn't find work. And that's all the people on Telegraph, all the vendors. I said I could make money doing portraits, which I did. And this town helped me. It, it got me to be where I am today. And I don't want to lose that energy. I want that energy to stay for other people so they can have a good, good life. Because the university don't care about you they don't care about the homeless. They say they do, but they really don't. Only thing they care about is money. That's right. Talk about it. That's right. That's all they want. They don't think about how this person going to live, how that person going to live when they kick them out of the park. They don't care because if they do, they ain't got no other place to go but on university, on telegraph, on a, on a Bancroft. And uh, San Pablo Avenue, they're going to send up tents all up down the streets. Because People Park won't be there. And we need to keep that park there for the next generation of people. If we don't do that, the whole Berkeley will fall apart. Because the park is a fabric of Berkeley. If you take the park away, Everything's gonna fall apart. It's gonna it's gonna deteriorate to nothingness. And we need that park. We need many more parks. That should be a people park in every city in America. That's right. And furthermore, there should be peace throughout the world and let people park be the ground zero to spread love throughout the world. To spread happiness and kindness, because that's what it's going to take. It's going to take kindness for all of us to work together as one. We can't we can't fight among each other because that feed into university super ass shit. We have to do this together, always, because there won't be a day left for us to spread our wings. We need to spread our wings. We need to spread everything. And the university is not going to stop it because we're going to be there to stop them. Yeah. Right on. Right. 
Thank you, everybody. And I hope everybody have a wonderful day out here in the hot sun. Hey,